Hello everyone, this is Chris Burns from Slash Gear. Today we're taking a look at the Lenovo Yoga Tablet 10. Now what we're going to show you here is the hardware at first. You can see there's uh, one, two forwards picking speakers there. Uh, along the back you have a sort of curve so it looks more like a, a book folded over. Uh, similar to what some of uh, Sony devices we've seen recently in the last year. Right here we have a single microphone hole as well as the volume tab up and down. Along the back, you have a tab that folds up. It has a couple of bumpers here. I love to stick on here just so you can see it gives you a basic instruction. You're just pulling it up. Uh, here you have a single back-facing camera, 5 megapixels without a little LED flash. On this, uh, on one side of two sides, you have a headphone jack there. On the other side, you have a power button. This power button has the LED behind it, so this power will be flashing off and on while you are having it in sleep mode. Here's a micro USB. It charges that way. Along this side it gets extremely thin and up on the top it again folds up to a sort of a book size. Now what you can do on the back is pull this out. Now you can pull this out to any sort of different direction up until here. It goes about to a 90 degree angle so your uh, tablet can sit up like that. Inside you can see that we have uh, two little slots here. This one is blocked. There's two right here. This one is blocked. This is where you would put your SIM card. Right here is the uh, micro SD card, which we have just a blocker in there for now, uh, but you'd be able to put up to a 64 gigabyte card in there for additional memory uh, internal. Now what you'd be doing here is putting a SIM card up to uh, 3G, I think it's 3 or, 3 or 4G, not remembered right now, but in the future the next edition will be working that way. Now what I'm going to do here is uh, press the power button, I'll do it right here while it's up in front of us. I can fold it, again I can fold it back to any part right here. If you fold it back too far, it'll end up falling down, but if you put it up to the correct height, it'll just stick up really nicely like that. I'll press the power button here, and you can see it looks really nice. Move in. I'm actually going to hold it down a little bit here. Uh, hold it up while we're going there. Inside you can see you have Android 4.2, which means you can go up from the bottom and go to Google Now. Go into there. Uh, you have Lenovo's own sort of structure here. I mean, you have their icons for certain things like a camera, people, settings, that sort of thing. But once you get inside, you'll see it is still uh, Google made. You have some oddities like this uh, slide, sidebar. You'll be able to turn that off and on. Uh, that'll be able to come in from the right just to show you. You'll see for more of that in the full review. And otherwise, it's pretty much normal stuff here. I pop back out to the front. You see that there is no applications drawer. What you're doing here is you're just going from side to side. It's more like uh, what uh, Apple does with iOS, where they have just these screens rather than going down into a dock uh, to find the rest of your apps. You can go down in the dock here to find other things like changing themes, looking at previews of your windows right there, and changing wallpapers and that sort of thing. Uh, here you have previews of your stuff like Yoga Tablet. You'll be able to watch a little video about the device. You have a calculator. This is one of the things that they've themed themselves, so you can use the calculator like that. Very cool. And uh, that's basically it. So check out the rest of the review. Uh, the tap looks really nice. You can, uh, one, more, one last thing, you can fold it down to, you know, sit up like this. So you're folding it, setting sort of staying up like that. But you can also pull it down so you can use it as a sort of a keyboard. If you do that, your whole thing will be flipped upside down like that. And you'll be able to key on it like that. Quite nice. Check it out.